Hitler just wanted to make Germany great and have things run well, okay, fine. I don't know Miss Owens. I'm not going to characterize her. I'm going to let her own words do the talking. So I'm going to play for you the first 30 seconds of a statement she made about Adolf Hitler. I agree. I, I actually don't have any problems at all with the word nationalism. I think that it gets, uh, the definition gets poisoned um, by elitists that actually want globalism. Globalism is what I, what I don't want. So when you think about whenever we say nationalism, the first thing people think about, in, at least in America, is Hitler. You know, he was a national socialist. But if Hitler just wanted to make Germany great and have things run well, okay, fine. The problem is, is that he wanted, he had dreams outside of Germany. He wanted to globalize. He wanted everybody to be German, everybody to be speaking German. All right, so my uh, first question is to Ms. Hershenoff. Ms. Owens said, quote, if Hitler just wanted to make Germany great and have things run well, okay, fine. The problem is that he wanted, he had dreams outside of Germany. So when people try to legitimize Adolf Hitler, does that feed into white nationalist ideology? It does, Mr. Liu. I know that uh, Ms. Owens distanced herself from those comments later, but we expressed great concern over the original comments. trying to present as if I was launching a defense of Hitler in Germany when in fact the question that was asked of me was pertaining to whether or not I believed that Hitler was a whether I, or not I believed in nationalism and that nationalism was bad and what I responded to was that I do not believe that we should be characterizing Hitler as a nationalist he was a homicidal psychopathic maniac that killed his own people a nationalist would not kill their own people Let me be clear. The hearing today is not about white nationalism or hate crimes. It's about fear-mongering, power, and control. It's a preview of a Democrat 2020 election strategy, same as the Democrat 2016 election strategy. We see today white nationalism as a rising threat around the world. I don't really. I think it's a uh, small group of people that have very, very serious problems. The danger, I think, uh, of white supremacist uh, violent extremism or any other kind of violent extremism um, is, of course, significant. We assess that it's a persistent, uh, pervasive threat. 